we'll ask about the captaincy later on. This back row looks like a very annoying back row. Yourself, Ours? yes. <laughs> um, what do you think the strengths and qualities of, of yourself, Ryan, and, and John are? Uh, I share a room with Ryan, so I know where you're coming from. Um, no, I think it's, it's a pretty good blend, to be honest. Um, I think Hamish has been playing really well um, as well, but I think, you know, Hard's made something slightly different. You know, he's a physical guy, and these guys play quite a direct physical game. Um, and then Wilson, you know, he played, he's played well for the last 18 months, two years. He was outstanding in, in the autumn and against Georgia. Um, so, yeah, it's exciting. It's a, not, not the heaviest of back rows, maybe, but certainly a back row that's, uh, that's mobile and likes to play. But. So you are captain of Scotland. What does that mean to you? Because, you, you know, nobody can really imagine what that's, that, that honour is like. So what, what does it actually mean to you personally? Um, so no, it's, it is a hard thing to, to explain, you know, I think running out of Murrayfield is special anyway, but, you know, I get to run out tomorrow in front of the team, it's going to be, it's going to be pretty special, my parents will be here, uh, a lot of my family and stuff, so, um, no, it's, you know, it's a massive honour for me, but, you know, with it comes a lot of responsibility, a lot of pressure, um, I think Greg, what Greg's done has been outstanding here, so, um, I've got to try and emulate some of the success he's had. In terms of the Welsh Challenge, you obviously, you play your rugby down there, um, what do you expect from them? What kind of game do you think they'll 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 bring to Murrayfield? They've not changed that much. They've they've had a lot of success. So why why would you change the way you play? You know they brought Scott in instead of Jamie Roberts. So perhaps more of a ball playing centre. Um, you know they've gone for two you know, two loose forwards, two open sides in the back row. So it looks like they're, they're playing a bit more. Um, but yeah, they're, they're physical. They're always physical to play against. They play a very physical brand of rugby. So, um, you kind of know what's coming. How much of you, I mean, it's maybe the wrong word to use, enjoy about the, the, the French game, but maybe the way that Scotland are playing offensively, particularly in the, the two games that have, you know, the Ireland yeah. game and the France game, how, how enjoyable is it to play in with that kind of ethos in the team? Yeah, so, certainly the Ireland game, um, we are really pleased. You know, you look back at the video and the energy and the intensity and the, the accuracy to do that at that level, it, that's the hardest thing, is to maintain that level of accuracy. Um, and people talked a lot after the France game. We were actually quite disappointed with how we played, a lot of the accuracy. Uh, we let ourselves down, and especially the last 20 minutes, we, we felt like we let the game get away from ourselves through through our own errors. So the challenge for us is to get back to that level we had in Ireland, You know, play with that level of intensity and physicality, but maintain the accuracy.